Hi, I'm Mel and I'm here to show you a day in the life of an on-construction domestic energy assessor. I'll be explaining what an on-construction domestic energy assessor or OCDEA does, what a typical assessment involves and how you can become an OCDEA. So first of all, what does an on-construction domestic energy assessor do? An OCDEA performs energy calculations for new build homes to make sure they comply with local building regulations. This happens at both the design stage and after the property is built, where the OCDEA will issue the necessary compliance reports and energy performance certificate for building control to sign off. An energy performance certificate gives a rating of A to G, A being the most energy efficient and G being the least. They're very important because you can't build a property without one. As part of an assessment, you will work from specifications provided by builders and use approved government software to calculate the energy efficiency score of the property. This involves analysing the construction details of the property, such as wall thickness and thermal bridging, as well as the heating system, levels of insulation and many other factors. It's a very consultative process where you'll be working with clients to ensure a building meets compliance and if required, select an appropriate energy saving measures. It definitely tests your problem solving skills, but it also makes the job very rewarding. The role is completely desk based so there aren't any visits to site and you won't need to buy a hard hat. It's very much working from plans and talking with clients. Why become an OCDEA? It's a really exciting time to be an OCDEA at the moment as the government has committed to building 300,000 new homes each year and every single one of them will need an EPC. The building regulations are also due to be updated this year which means there's going to be a lot of value placed on OCDEAs who will be helping developers navigate this change. So you'll be in high demand. And last but not least, you'll be helping to design houses of the future to ensure they're as energy efficient as possible and therefore reducing the UK's carbon emissions. It's a great feeling to know that you're contributing to help protect the environment and you'll definitely get a lot of job satisfaction. And lastly, how do you become an OCDEA? To become an OCDEA, you'll need to attend a four day qualification course, which will provide you with all of the skills and knowledge that you'll need. Once you've completed the course and submitted your portfolio, you're good to go. You don't need any prior experience of energy assessment or buildings before joining the course, but it's always beneficial. For that reason, this line of work will be of interest to existing energy assessors of any strand, as well as architects, builders, surveyors, and those just looking to add another string to their bow. If you'd like to find out more about OCDEA training, then visit the Elmhurst website or get in touch and we'll be happy to answer your questions. Thank you and I hope to see you on a course soon.